Welcome. 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 Good evening and welcome to Thornley Salesian College. I'm delighted to have the opportunity to introduce this evening and also to formally start our partnership journey together. A partnership that I hope will continue to strengthen and develop over the next seven years. After the most turbulent 15 months in education for all of us, I want to reassure you that we are ready to welcome your child to our school. We have got systems and structures in place which will mean we can get to know your child quickly, both personally and academically, so that we meet their needs and ensure that they flourish in our school. Joining our community is more than just joining a school. You are joining our worldwide Salesian family and everything that that has got to offer. We can't wait to meet you in person in September, but for now, I'd like you to take the time this evening to enjoy everything that our school has got to offer for your child. Let me tell you about Don Bosco. Don Bosco was born on the 16th of August, 1815. Don Bosco had two older brothers, Anthony and Joseph. The three brothers live with their mum, who we now call Mama Margaret. At the age of nine, Don Bosco had a dream, where Mary and Jesus inspired him to dedicate his life caring for children, especially those children who had nobody to love them. Don Bosco had a mission. His mission was to tell all young people that they are gifted, talented and loved not only loved by the people around them, but also by God. Don Bosco inspired children around the world through teachings and games. The first children to stay with Don Bosco became the first brothers and priests in the Salesian family. They helped spread Don Bosco's mission around the world. Today, there are over 15,000 Salesians and over 1,500 schools just like ours. We are a Salesian school because we follow in the footsteps of Don Bosco and show off our gifts and talents. We respect each other, learn to understand, and show affection by caring for those around us. And we use our sense of humour by laughing and having fun. At the core of Don Bosco's philosophy is to build a love for learning among young people. And this plays a central role here at Thornley Salesian College too. But it's about a full education, a full curriculum, one that opens up new and exciting opportunities for you to showcase your current talents and develop new ones. There is obviously a key focus here on our core subjects of maths, science, English and religion. And these are subjects where our students flourish, working with dynamic, caring and inspirational teachers who are extremely supportive and deliver engaging lessons that will enhance that love of learning. But here at Thornley Salesian College we are about so much more. In delivering Don Bosco's full curriculum, we place great emphasis on allowing you to enhance your skills and talents in all subject areas, while pushing you to leave your comfort zone and open yourself up to new subjects, new interests, new talents. Our new STEAM, music and drama centres allow us to provide you with a hands-on, practical avenue in which to explore these new opportunities. Let's take a look at some of these. The best part of joining Thornley is the drama studio. It has blacked out curtains and proper lighting and it gives out a professional feel. Drama has been such a fun and exciting subject to learn. Our drama group is made up of students from all across the year group, meaning I have made so many new and wonderful friends. Whether you're shy or love performing, everyone is supportive and encouraging. We have had opportunities to sing, dance, write and perform our own scripts. But it's not just that. The games we play in drama are so different to anything else I've done before. That's why I love being a part of it. We also have Drama Club after school on Tuesday where we study the subject more. It's great to get out of the classroom and take part in individual and team events. At Thornley, your PE lesson can take place in the sports hall, the gym, the AstroTurf, one of our outdoor sports fields or on the huge main yard. This year we have played rounders, football, basketball, gymnastics, netball, athletics and orienteering. This allows us to take part in our variety of sports. It doesn't just stop with our peer lessons, there's loads of lunchtime and after school sports clubs to get involved with. There is definitely something for everybody. It's been a great way to meet new people from new forms that have the same interests as you. 
We are very lucky here at Thornley to have a brand new STEAM block with specialist rooms fully equipped for STEAM learning. In science, we have learned more about chemistry, biology and physics. We've been looking at the periodic table and taking part in experiments and looking at chemical reactions. It's great to take part in these experiments. We've also looked at the makeup of plants in the process of photosynthesis. Our teachers really make our topics come to life and show us how what we are learning can be seen in everyday life. A lot of the work we have done in our STEAM subjects this year have been closely linked together to show how these topics interlink in our everyday lives. It has been great to see the work we've done in maths can also be used in our IT lessons. We've also been completing our STEAM awards and we've heard that many of you are starting your STEAM tasks in your primary schools at the minute. We've learned about binary code, variables and sequences and how to code our own programmes in IT lessons. We've also took part in online safety courses to make sure that we're all safe when online. In art, we start the year with a big project, looking and learning about the artist Hunter Vassar. This has been a really interesting topic where we do a lot of work with colour, looking at how artists use primary and secondary colours to use the impacts they want on their work. We have then seen how he and his work has impacted our world of architecture. Our teachers encourage us to show our creative side and we have had countless opportunities to showcase our work. In our design technology lessons, we have looked at how to draw 2D and 3D images along with mirror images which has helped us to gain a better understanding of technical graphics. We are very lucky to have a 3D printer in our classroom. It has been great to see our designs come to life while learning about the operational side of the printer. One of the most important parts of what we have learnt this year is on the safety side of design technology and always making sure that we use the equipment correctly. Music is something that I've always been interested in and the facilities available to us has really heightened that interest. We are always encouraged to try something new and understanding the theory behind it all has been really interesting. We have a fully equipped performing arts block at Thornley with specialist music rooms and even a recording studio. The staff are brilliant with helping us no matter what instrument you play or would like to play so it's easy to pick up a new instrument and get started here. As part of the music department, you'll get lots of opportunities to go on music trips and events. This includes singing at the Christmas markets. We are really looking forward to the school musicals and concerts starting back up again, such as Rock Band Night. Chaplaincy is a very important room here at Farnley Station College. Here we get the opportunity to go to Mass and to come here at break and lunchtime and play games. In Year 7, you will also have the chance to go on retreat to a place called Savio House. As a member of the Student Council, I represent the views of my friends and classmates and shape the future that we want it to be. I enjoy being a student leader and hope to carry this on next year. I recommend you take part when you join us in September. Here at Thornley there are so many things to get involved with. If you like sport, music, art or drama. Also there are so many trips to experience. This is a really exciting time for you and your family and moving to secondary school opens up so many new wonderful opportunities for you all. We have a wealth of experience between us in helping year six students seamlessly make the move to secondary education and we've been working behind the scenes with your primary schools over the past few months to ensure this happens. In year seven we set extremely high standards to ensure you are given the platform you need to reach your full potential. And this is done through building a strong Year 7 community with the four central Salesian principles at its core of respect, understanding, affection and humour. We can't wait for you all to join us here in Year 7 next year, get you started on this exciting stage of your educational journey and welcome you to so much more. Hi, my name is Mrs O'Grady and I am the Assistant Year Leader for Year 7. I am a non-teaching member of staff who is there to support and deal with the day-to-day -day running of the Year Group. We are really looking forward to building strong relationships with you all and we will be there every step of the way to ensure you have a really positive experience in joining us here at Thornley Salesian College. Hi, I'm Mrs Pickup and I'm part of the inclusion team here at Thornley Salesian College. I'll be linked to the New Year 7s who will be joining us here in September and it's been wonderful to see so many of the children in primary school visits recently. I'm a point of contact for all parents and carers who may have any concerns about their child's learning whilst at school. I also run a quiet lunch and break club for any children who feel that they need a break from the busy yard. 
I also have an overview of interventions to support children's learning whilst at school, for example in numeracy, literacy, reading and spelling. Hello, I'm Mr Birchby. I'm going to be Seven Alphas form tutor in September. A, a little known fact about myself is I've visited over 90 football grounds around the world with the favourite one being Wembley Stadium. I'm really looking forward to being your form tutor in September. Hi, my name is Miss Yusuf. I'm a maths teacher at Thornley and I'm going to be Seven Beaters form tutor next year. An interesting fact about me is that I am ambidextrous. I'm looking forward to seeing you all in September. See you soon. Hi guys, I'm Mr Taylor, I'm going to be the form tutor for Seven Gamma and I'm looking forward to seeing you all in September. A little known fact about me is I used to be a games developer. See you soon. Hi, I'm Miss Brindle and I'm going to be the form tutor for Seven Delta. A um, little interesting fact about me is that I recently got a puppy, it's called Teddy, so I might get to show you a few pictures when you come in in September and I can't wait to meet you then. Hello, my name is Mr Pritchard and I will be the form tutor for Seven Zeta next year. A little interesting fact about me, I'm a Manchester City fan and I do some film reviews and stuff like that, podcasts and things in my spare time. I'm really looking forward to seeing you and welcoming you to Team Seven Zeta next year. Hi everyone, uh, my name is Miss Jarvis and I'm going to be the form tutor this year for Seven Kappa. A little known fact about me, I'm a black belt in karate and I love to travel. Uh, my favourite country that I've travelled to is Vietnam. Can't wait to see you all next year. See you later. Hi, my name is Miss Pearson and I'm going to be Seven Theatres Farm Tutor in September. An unknown fact about me is I'm a trained West End dancer and I cannot wait to see you in September. Hi, I'm Miss Duffy and I'm going to be the Farm Tutor for Seven Sigma. An interesting fact about me is I've got a big metal plate in my arm. I'm really looking forward to seeing you in September. Hi, I'm Mr McGreevy, Seven Landers Farm Teacher. An interesting fact about me is that I'm into tie boxing. I'm looking forward to seeing you all next year. Hi, my name is Miss Munchie. I am going to be Seven Omega's form tutor. Um, a fact about me is that I'm a big Liverpool football club, so I'm hoping there's a few reds in Seven Omega next year, and I can't wait to meet you all in September. Well, I hope you've enjoyed what you've seen tonight, and thank you so much for joining us for our welcome evening this evening. We as a team and as a school are so excited to welcome you all here next year and bring you all to so much more.